Well, good evening everybody. I'm standing out here in my alfalfa field. Um, this field's like two years old, I think. And I guess what brings me out here today is I'm just looking at the damage from the freeze. And I'll, I'll show you guys that here in a second. I just want to talk about something else quick. While I'm out here, um, you know, last night I think I was on Facebook or, or this morning. And I was scrolling through some of my some of my friends' posts or whatever, and, and uh, I seen something with somebody here local. They uh, they were out looking at their alfalfa, and had a picture of it, and you know, this alfalfa here is not looking very good. You know, look at that, it's just turning black. And they they were saying, you know, our alfalfa froze last night hard. It got actually down to about 18. 18 20 degrees around here some alfalfa fields took it better than others and others are looking really good ours luckily does not look terrible but is what i'm getting at here on that facebook post um on the facebook post there um, somebody commented and they must have been from florida and uh and then people from Florida, they said, well, just come to Florida at 76 degrees or 80 degrees or whatever the world it is. Temperature don't really matter. Kind of joking about it being cold up here. You know, while I'm walking around this alfalfa field. You know, that's not really a whole joking matter when someone's just showing the damage um, done by the frost to an alfalfa field. You know, it is not not really a laughing matter at all I mean that's someone's livelihood this alfalfa field here which obviously we haven't took the bales off last year because luckily we had extra hay last year feed them cows all winter and along with other things so if somebody loses their crop to a freeze um it's just not fun so anyhow I just a little I just this is my little rant for the day, I guess. Just don't like how people people don't understand this egg deal isn't all fun and games. But yeah, you can just see I don't know how well it's showing up on the video, but you can just see the you know, alfalfa is just not pretty. That right there is what alfalfa is supposed to look like. Not that. It's all black and wilted. Not really sure why, you know, what the rhyme or reason behind. You know, here, for instance, look at this row. You know, there's a couple plants there that look terrible, and then you go over, and that one's got nipped just a little bit. But for the most part, that one looks okay. This one just got nipped terrible. Um, not exactly sure what the extent of this uh, freeze is going to be. I personally think it's going to be okay. Um, I think it's going to cut our first cutting yield back. I don't think it's going to have long-term effects. But it is what it is. I think we'll be cutting hay, alfalfa hay just a little bit later than normal, I guess. And it is what it is. But we'll, uh, we'll see what happens, I guess. So, I guess everybody, please uh, comment, rate, and subscribe. Hope you don't mind my rant for the day. And, um, I guess that's, that's it.